Ladies and gentlemen, I go by the name of Arlo Maverick, man of many hats who just happens to rap. And today I want to talk to you about YouTube playlists. Now, if you are an artist, you should have a YouTube channel. And with that channel, you should have playlists in order to make it easier for people who visit your site to actually find the things that they need. So today I wanted to go over a few different playlists that might be beneficial to you in order to connect you with your fans and with the industry. Playlist number one, interviews. Interviews provide an insight into you both as an artist and as a person. So if you have interviews that are floating around on YouTube, whether it's ones that you created or ones that are from another website or YouTube channel, then compile them into a playlist. That way, when people are trying to better understand you as an artist or a person, they could actually go through it and be like, OK, I better understand this artist. Playlist number two, music videos. Music videos are great because they allow for you to be able to showcase and build your brand. So if you have music videos that are on YouTube, compile them into a playlist as well too if you have guest features on other people's songs that actually made into video format then add that to the playlist as well too show your diversity show your artistic expression and allow for people to become a bigger fan of your music plus music videos are usually a great way for you to be able to um, let a song resonate more than it did when someone was just listening to it because the visuals might be so crazy that people are just like yo this is dope so if you have music videos put them into a playlist Playlist number three, live performances. To help you book shows, whether it be festivals or tours, whatever the case may be, compile a playlist of great footage of you on stage performing. Allow for this footage to showcase how you're able to connect with an audience, how you're able to connect with your band, and show that you're a great front person because this is what's gonna allow you to book more shows and also build your social proof and also build your fan base. So if you have performances, whether it be something that was filmed by somebody else and it's on their YouTube channel or something that you uploaded yourself, compile that into a playlist so then someone who's actually going to book you can now see that, yo, this person here really knows how to perform, but make sure it's your best stuff. Make sure it's stuff that you are, are winning over an audience with. Playlist number four, virtual performances. Sometimes you'll have great live footage, but the audio sucks. So in situations like that, what you should do is try to film in-studio performances or virtual performances. And basically what this is, is you are filming a performance of your song, but in a closed environment, something that's more controlled. Playlist number five, your process. This is something that I am very guilty of not doing. Document your process and then compile it into a playlist so that your fans can actually get to better understand how you create music and how you create what you do as an artist. Because as artists, we don't think about the fact that people actually find what we do fascinating. We think that the end product is all that the customer cares about. But a lot of times they actually want to know how you got to that. So create a playlist that documents some of your process, whether it be your rehearsals, whether it be you creating a music video or you creating an, a song, whatever the case may be, allow them to actually get a better look into what you do as an artist. In closing, I want to thank you for checking out this vlog. If you found yourself to be more informed by the end of it, then please make sure to click the like button as well too. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, which is youtube.com slash Arlo Maverick as well. Please make sure you join us in the comments where we are trying to build a community. So if there's something you want to share in regards to playlists uh, that artists can be creating, then please put it in the comments below as well too. Don't forget to find me on my multiple social media platforms at Arlo Maverick on everything. And until the next episode, ladies and gentlemen, peace.